Let's now determine the Laplace transform of the step function. So once again, f of s is going to equal the Laplace transform of u of t, which is equal to the integral from 0 to infinity. And you'll notice I'm getting a little bit sloppy here. We can go ahead and put in the 0 minus. Um, now, between 0 minus and 0 plus is the discontinuity, so we're going to change this to plus because the contributions prior to that will be 0 and just call it then 1 because the unit step function over this integral is just 1 e to the minus st dt. Now when we do that integration we end up with we kick a negative 1 over s out in front times e to the minus st evaluated at the limits and that gives us then negative 1 over s times, as we've seen in the past, we're going to see it over and over again as we're doing this, e to the minus infinity, the upper limit is 0, minus e to the 0, which is 1. And we have then the Laplace transform of the unit step function is just 1 over s.